just we'll jump in. Got a few questions I want to kind of go through with you and um, get your feedback. So, as I mentioned to start, we have been a partner with Graystar for now over seven years. Um, and the first question is from your seat, uh, what contributes to the success and the longevity of our partnership? So as we have, you know, developed this partnership and this relationship over the past seven years, you know, we're working with the same folks in some instances that we've worked with since day one, yourself included, right? And so what that allows us to do is to really build a deep relationship and partnership with those individuals. And what that leads to is, you know, obviously that, you know, the teamwork and the collaboration, but not only that, but the trust. And in any type of relationship that has longevity and success, trust is a foundation and that deals, that is all stemming back to the people that we work with. Um, obviously, Graystar's had immense growth in the last just couple years um, on a couple different sides of multifamily and the student. Um, so with that growth, how has Conservus and our team been able to support that growth? We've got a team that we have that deep relationship with and we know who to go to and we know how to, you know, who to reach out to. But also what, what Conservus has done a great job is, is as we've grown with number of units and in all these different markets, Conservus has also grown with us, meaning that you're adding support and dedicated resources to our team, which is great because, again, that allows us to continue that, that level of service not only to our internal customers, meaning our team members, but also our clients are used to. Um, can you share some of the utility pain points you've experienced? I know you've been doing this for a long time. And then how the Conservus team has helped minimize or overcome those, again, kind of with you, kind of lockstep moving through the process? There's always the pain point of making sure that our on-site team and our regional managers really understand utility billing and also reimbursements. And so making sure that that training is there where you all have made sure that we have the training available and can be there to answer questions for new team members so that we don't have any loss of, um, I would say, forward movement with regards to the utility billing, utility reimbursement. One of the opportunities that we've had, which has been a great value to us, and we hope for Graystar and your teams as well too, not just at the corporate level, but also at the regional level, is uh, the national events and the meetings uh, outside of the NAA and the NMHC, but actually your events, it takes place every couple of years in Florida. And then your teams being able to come visit us at our annual retreats, which is great mm -hmm. for you to spend time with your peers and share information, which is where a lot of the, you know, the things that we've talked about prior to this have fed into that. It's, it's where we get our growth. Um, where do you see the benefits of those, that, that mutually sharing of data and information from us participating in your events and then also Graystar being able to participate with the Conservice teams? Sometimes having those downtimes allows for more creative thinking and maybe figuring out like, hey, we've never talked about this. Maybe we should do this or we should do that. And it just allows that natural brainstorming to happen, which I think then it helps to evolve the processes um, and just, again, that knowledge base and that level of trust with, with both teams. And I think that's absolutely critical for a long-term partnership. So much gets done at the corporate level, which is extremely important. Yeah. But to be, for us to be able to take that down to the regional level and have that interaction is, is, you know, we think has been critical to our success as well, too, and why we value the partnership. In your, from your opinion, uh, what's the number one reason that drives that partnership, that preferred partnership? You know, it's people, right? It's, it's the, it is people and it's building the trust and it's building the partnership and the collaboration if you don't have the right people, you don't have the trust. And I would say Conservus has the right people. You are, you have experts, you have individuals that are willing to help and get on the phone with us or get with, you know, get with us when we can meet in person. And just, as you said, right, block and tackle and solve problems. But it's building that relationship and that trust that is so critical, not just for our internal team members, but also for our, our clients. Um, professionally and personally, great to visit with you and really good to see you again. It's been, it's been a while. So I look forward to uh, getting out to Phoenix in the next couple of months and, um, and uh, catching up with you. 
Okay, sounds good. I'll hold you to it, Carrie. All right, always. Thank you very much.